It has been lots of years since Jair Khan has retired from international cricket, but I think there are millions of youngsters who are trying to be a fast bowler like Jair Khan. So if you have already idolized Jair Khan and have been trying to be a bowler like him, first of all, you have to know the kinds of variations Jair Khan used to bowl. Today in this video, I will show you the kinds of variations Jair Khan had and how he used to bowl those. So don't skip watch this video till the end. I think this video is going to help you a lot. Oh, and he's gone right through. Well, so I have gone through a long analysis on Jair Khan's all video clips that are existing on YouTube and what I found Jair Khan had 5 major deliveries. Those are in-swing, out-swing, a reverse-swing type of delivery, your car and the final delivery and obviously a very dangerous delivery, a innovative delivery by Jair Khan that was a knockable ball. So let's discuss about these five major deliveries one by one. And now Bradley goes to deal with, deal with that delivery. Look at that, he's well, played inside the... was a fast bowler and he could ball around 140 km per hour. All that later part of his career, his speed resumed a lot and he used to ball around 130 km per hour. But that was his stroke delivery. Obviously, every fast bowler's stroke delivery is a quick delivery. Now, if you can swing the ball at least in one direction, you are good. But if you can swing the ball in both directions, which is very rare among fast bowlers today, then you are exceptional. And Joel Khan had this capability of swinging the ball into both ways. Normally, Joel Khan, as I have told you, could ball very quick deliveries, 130 km per hour almost and around 140 km per hour and along with that as quick delivery he could swing the ball into both ways but most of the time he used to swing the ball into right handed batsman and who is used to swing air from left handed batsman and how he used to bowl this delivery he used to grip normally every fast bowler's grip is same every left hand fast bowler's grip is same for the in swing delivery that the ball to right handed batsman normally you have to grip the ball like this way this is normal same of grip but you have to grip the ball like this way and then you have to release the ball like this way the ball will go on this direction and it will swing into right handed batsman and it will swing away from left handed batsman so this was Zohir Khan's in swing delivery to right handed batsman Gone! Beautiful delivery! Full bowling from Zahir Khan always dangerous when a left arm bowler swings the ball back into a right hander He used to ball this delivery most of the time with the new ball but sometimes he used to ball out swing delivery. I mean, this is a normal in swing delivery for a left handed bowler. But if you will, you will ball it to a right handed batsman, this will become a, a out swing delivery. So, how, how he used to bowl this delivery? He used to grip the ball like this way. Normally, every first bowler's grip is same for bowling this delivery. So, what you have to do, you have to swing, release the ball like this way. Just out swing delivery, and the ball will go like this. And it will swing air from right handed batsman. And now Bradley goes to deal with, deal with that delivery. Look at that, he's played inside the inside edge and taken twice in two overs. Threatening bowler when it swings. So, this was his extra delivery, quick delivery with swinging into both ways. And he was very good in bowling these two types of deliveries. Now, the third delivery of Joel Khan was his reverse swing delivery. Now, uh, today, I won't discuss about reverse swing a lot because the discussion of reverse swing is little bit sophisticated. It will take lots of time to discuss it properly. So if you want me to make a video only individually on reverse swing, then, then let me know by commenting below. In future, I try my best to make a video only on reverse swing. So Joel Khan could ball with excellent reverse swing. So what you used to do normally for bowling reverse swing, you don't need to use the grip of the ball normally the way you swing the ball with the new ball with the old ball you can use the same grip and ball but this time you have to change the direction of the shiny bar there is some science linked to it so everything i will discuss on that video that i will i will make on reverse swing so what jail khan used to do he used to grip the ball like this way with new ball the grip that he used to normally used for bowling his in swing delivery towards right handed batsman this time he used to grip the ball like the same way he used to release the ball but this time instead of the ball going towards this direction the ball used to go in this direction like it used to become a out swing delivery 
to a right-handed batsman and the in-swing delivery to a left-handed batsman. So this was his reverse swing delivery. And that's two wickets. It's a full, full length delivery. The fourth delivery of Jair Khan was his Yorker. Jair Khan was very good in bowling Yorker deliveries. And normally we know how to bowl a Yorker. There is no specialized grip for bowling Yorker. Whether you feel comfortable, seam up or cross seam grip, whatever you feel comfortable, you can use this grip. And you have to put the ball on the York lane on the batsman and the ball will become Yorker. Gone, is it? This ball dip. Now one exceptional thing that used to become few of Jair Khan deliveries that used to um, become both a reverse swing and a Yorker. So normally um, he used to ball the same reverse, reverse swing delivery but he, when he used to uh, target to ball Yorker then both things used to happen. Yorker and a reverse swing delivery and normally this type of delivery used to become very dangerous for Jair Khan. And he picked up the wicket of Android Strauss in 2011 World Cup by bowling this type of delivery. Fifth delivery and final delivery of Joir Khan was the innovative delivery, obviously, and that was his knuckle ball. Now, there is a confusion. People, most of the people think that Jair Khan is the pioneer of knuckle ball. Jair Khan started bowling knuckle ball for the first time, but I think uh, this, there is a, this is a misconception among people because I think uh, Charles Langaveld from South Africa he started bowling knuckle ball. So there has been a cons confusion about this point, but one thing is clear that is the bowler who started performing well by bowling knuckle ball, who started picking up lots of wickets by bowling knuckle ball was obviously Jairkan without having any confusion in your mind. Out, easy, taken, then goes, West Indies 8 down. And uh, normally Jahir can develop this delivery targeting 2011 World Cup and in this World Cup his only solo delivery was this knuckle ball and he picked up lots of wickets by bowling this knuckle ball. Now how to bowl a knuckle ball? I have already uploaded a video um, in my channel where I described about how to bowl a knuckle ball. So if you missed that video you can find the video on the i button. But today one more time I am going to discuss about this knuckle ball. So what you have to do for bowling this knuckle ball, you have to, you know this is a knuckle ball grip. So you have to bend your knuckle like this way and put the ball over the seam or wherever you find comfortable. You can put your knuckles over the cross seam as well. Wherever you find comfortable, you can use this grip. But most of the pace bowlers put their knuckle over the seam and they hold the ball like this way and they release the ball like this way. The ball normally uh, goes without any spinning movement just it flies on the ear and it automatically becomes solo normally the advantage for pulling a knuckle ball is it is a solo delivery but you don't need to solo your hand rotation you just you can uh, rotate you can release the ball like the same quick stock delivery rotation but the ball if you release this knuckle ball the ball will automatically become solo on the ear He's gone right through. Well, what a delivery. So this was my overall analysis on Jair Khan's bowling. I have tried to discuss all kinds of major deliveries that, that Jair Khan used to bowl. And probably you can think that probably I have skipped one delivery that is a bouncer. Normally every first bowler in the world ball bouncer. This is not an exceptional thing. So that's why I haven't counted this delivery as a variety of Jair Khan's bowling. Normally every first bowler ball bouncer. So hopefully I have enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.